Adobe Premiere Tutorial 2, Step 2, Cropping Your Footage. Open Premiere, open a new project, call the new project your last name, Shoot 2. Tell Premiere Pro where you wish to save the project. So I've named it Shoot 2, I've told it where I want it to be saved, and now I can click OK. I need to go to the File menu and select Import. And then go to the folder where I've saved my video footage and open the video footage. And you should be able to see here if I click on the project tab at the top, you can see a preview of the video footage I've just imported. I'm now going to drag this video footage onto the timeline. And you can see I have the video footage in here. Next, I'm going to crop the footage. I need to go to the effects. Panel. If you can't see it, it might be hidden on one of these little arrows that goes across. Or you can click on Window and make sure Effects is ticked and it will come up here. I'm going to type Crop into the search. And under Video Effects Transform, you can see Crop here. I'm going to click and drag Crop directly over the top video footage or the video footage that's in the V1 channel. And now I need to go to the Effects Controls panel. And again, if you can't see it, go to the window and make sure Effects Controls is checked and you will see it appear in your dialog box over here. I need to find Crop and here it is here. If this drop down arrow isn't open, click on it. And I'm going to use these controls here. Starting with the bottom option, I'm just going to hover my mouse over the blue percentage next to bottom. And I'm going to click and drag to the right. And you can see the percentage changes, but also the bottom of the image changes. And I'm going to crop that to where I think is appropriate. Now on the top, I'm going to do the same thing. And just crop it to where I think is appropriate, which is just above my newsreader's head.